And it's one of these dances, of course, that reads very easy. And then, of course, you're in the middle of it, and you're going like, wow, wake up. You know the feeling, right? <laughs> and it's going to finish with Paul Harrowbird, which we've been, some of us have been trying in class. And that dance is actually devised by Hugh Foss. And uh, Hugh Foss was uh, quite the force to be reckoned with, actually, in, in Bletchley, in Bletchley Park. He was a code breaker, and he just loved Scottish country dancing. Now, funnily enough, when you do actually read about Hugh Foss, he uh, was one of the people that was able to um, break the Enigma code, and he actually also broke a Japanese code on May 8th. And May 8th is actually Hugh Foss Day. And the funny thing is, when you read about him personally, it does say that his hobbies were Scottish country dancing and devising dances. And he was just one of these guys that would come to work in his Birkenstocks. He had long flowing hair in that time, and uh, he was just one of these math brains. So when you're watching this dance, you're sort of thinking, oh my goodness. When, is this thing falling apart and then all of a sudden the whole thing comes back together? So, we'll start with the wee medley. The first one's the pipe opener. I said that right, didn't I? Yeah, yes. no, I think we're good. And then we'll go into this Paul Harrowburn and Hugh Foss dance. Good. And the music is Luke Brady, one of our younger Scottish country dance musicians. <laughs> 